Welcome, budget-savvy adventurers! Today, we embark on an exciting expedition through the realm of financial prowess. Get ready to unearth the secrets to building substantial wealth, even when navigating the constraints of a tight budget. As we delve into the art of smart saving, savvy spending, and shrewd investment, prepare to unlock the gateway to a prosperous future. So subscribe to the channel and let's embark on this transformative fiscal odyssey together in the quest to how to build wealth on a tight budget, unveiling eight essential lessons. Let's dive headfirst into the first lesson from How to Build Wealth on a Tight Budget, and that is the wealth formula, income plus expenses equals cash flow. The story of Ronald Red, whose face was featured in all media after his death in June 2014 due to a well-kept secret, sheds light on the extraordinary possibilities of amassing significant wealth. Despite not fitting the mold of a classic millionaire, Ronald managed to accumulate a staggering $8 million. How did he do it? Did he rob a bank? Did he win the lottery? Did he inherit a fortune from a long-lost relative? No, he simply followed the wealth formula. You see, when it comes to building wealth on a tight budget, understanding the wealth formula is paramount. The equation is simple yet powerful. Your income minus your expenses equals your cash flow. This fundamental concept forms the bedrock of financial stability and growth, especially when resources are limited. Let's delve into the practical application of this formula through the experiences of our friends, John and Emma. John meticulously tracks his income and minimizes his expenses to ensure a healthy cash flow. By maintaining a clear understanding of his financial inflows and outflows, John maximizes his savings potential and investment opportunities, thereby laying the groundwork for long-term financial security. Conversely, Emma grapples with her spending habits, often neglecting to factor in her expenses against her income. As a result, her cash flow remains volatile, leading to financial strain and limited prospects for wealth accumulation. By recognizing the significance of the wealth formula, Emma can strategically manage her expenses and optimize her income to cultivate a more robust financial foundation for the future. Understanding the wealth formula empowers you to make informed financial decisions, prioritize effective budgeting strategies, and pave the way for sustainable wealth creation, even within stringent financial constraints. It serves as the cornerstone for prudent financial management and serves as a guiding principle for individuals seeking to build wealth steadily and efficiently. With a clear understanding of the wealth formula, you can prioritize and allocate your financial resources efficiently, ensuring that they maximize their income potential and minimize unnecessary expenditures. By adhering to the principles outlined in the wealth formula, you can streamline your budgeting practices, identify areas for potential cost-cutting, and direct your financial resources toward investments and assets that contribute to long-term wealth accumulation and financial stability. Moreover, the wealth formula serves as a guiding principle that enables you to assess your financial health, meaning identify potential areas for improvement and implement strategies that align with your long-term financial objectives. By leveraging the wealth formula as a guide that compasses in the intricate landscape of financial management, allowing individuals to establish a solid foundation for their fiscal journey. By integrating the wealth formula into their financial decision-making process, individuals can cultivate a disciplined and proactive approach to wealth management. This involves meticulous tracking of income and expenses, enabling a comprehensive understanding of their financial landscape. With this clarity, individuals can prioritize effective budgeting strategies, identify potential areas for improvement, and make informed investment decisions aligned with their long-term financial goals. No doubt, the wealth formula, therefore, acts as a fundamental tool that empowers individuals to navigate the complexities of their financial trajectory, fostering a sense of control and confidence in their ability to build and maintain sustainable wealth even within the confines of a tight budget. All right, let's dive into the next lesson from How to Build Wealth on a Tight Budget. And that is, adjust your finances. Imagine you have the power to shape your financial future, starting today. Sounds too good to be true, right? Well, it's not. This lesson underscores the significance of early financial planning, 
emphasizing the critical role of timely and consistent savings in securing a prosperous tomorrow. Let's explore the impact of initiating savings at various stages of life. If you begin saving at the age of 20, setting aside $204 per month sets you on a trajectory towards financial security. As you embark on this journey earlier, your contributions have the advantage of compounding interest, generating greater wealth over time. Plus, you get to enjoy the perks of being a savvy saver, such as bragging rights, peace of mind, and extra cash for splurging on avocado toast. By contrast, Start Savings at 30 demands a more substantial commitment of $443 per month while waiting until 40 necessitates an even more significant investment of $1,200 monthly. Starting at 50 requires a considerable commitment of $2,795 per month. Ouch! That's a lot of money to part with, especially when you have other expenses to worry about, like mortgage, kids, and retirement. Not to mention the looming threat of inflation, recession, and alien invasion. The key takeaway here is the monumental influence of early action. By initiating savings at a younger age, individuals harness the power of compounding interest and incremental contributions to facilitate wealth accumulation and ensure a more feasible path to their financial aspirations. Or, in simpler terms, the sooner you start saving, the richer you'll be. While this method streamlines the savings process, it's essential to note that a detailed budget remains beneficial, particularly for those grappling with spending issues or seeking to enhance financial stability. A comprehensive financial plan enables individuals to align their spending habits with their long-term financial goals, fostering greater financial discipline and resilience. It also helps you avoid the pitfalls of overspending, such as debt, stress, and regret. Ultimately, the pivotal message remains clear. Early and consistent savings serve as a cornerstone for securing a stable financial future. By implementing prudent financial strategies and cultivating a disciplined approach to savings, Individuals can pave the way for a prosperous and secure tomorrow, even in the face of budgetary constraints. And who doesn't want that? This disciplined approach to savings not only fosters a sense of financial security and preparedness, but also serves as a safeguard against potential financial uncertainties and challenges that may arise, such as unexpected medical bills, car repairs, or zombie apocalypse. You never know when you might need some extra cash to survive. By embracing the habit of consistent savings, you can lay the groundwork for a prosperous and secure tomorrow, fostering a sense of confidence and stability within the constraints of your budgetary limitations. And that, my friends, is the ultimate goal of this lesson, to help you achieve financial freedom and happiness, no matter how tight your budget is. Moving on to the next lesson from How to Build Wealth on a Tight Budget, and that is How to Increase Your Investments. When it comes to building wealth on a tight budget, it's crucial to understand how to optimize and expand your investments. The following strategies can aid individuals in maximizing their investment potential, even within financial constraints. Diversification. Allocate funds across different asset classes to spread risk and enhance potential returns. Diversifying investments, such as exploring stocks, bonds, and real estate, can offer stability and growth prospects over time. It also helps you avoid putting all your eggs in one basket, which is never a good idea, unless you're making a giant omelet. Next up, we have systematic investing. Implement a systematic investment plan that allows for consistent contributions over an extended period. By contributing fixed amounts regularly, you can capitalize on the power of compounding interest and build a robust investment portfolio. Think of it as a snowball effect except with money instead of snow, and without the risk of getting hit in the face. Coming up, long-term orientation. Embrace a long-term perspective when it comes to investments. 
Patience and persistence are key components in generating substantial returns, especially in the face of market fluctuations and economic uncertainties. Don't let short-term losses or gains distract you from your long-term goals. Remember, Rome wasn't built in a day, and neither was Warren Buffett's fortune. Professional Guidance Seek advice from financial advisors or investment professionals to gain insights into effective investment strategies tailored to your specific financial goals and risk tolerance. They can help you navigate the complex and ever-changing world of finance and steer you away from potential pitfalls and scams. Just make sure they're qualified and trustworthy and not some random guy on the internet who claims to have a secret formula for making millions. Continuous Learning Stay abreast of market trends and investment opportunities through continuous learning. Enhancing financial literacy equips you with the knowledge and tools needed to make informed investment decisions and capitalize on emerging prospects. You can learn from books, podcasts, blogs, courses, videos from this channel, or even from your own mistakes. The more you know, the more you grow. By adopting these investment strategies, you can effectively navigate the complex financial landscape and cultivate a robust investment portfolio, fostering sustainable wealth accumulation and long-term financial security. These techniques empower you to make prudent investment decisions and optimize your financial resources, ultimately setting the stage for a prosperous and stable financial future. And who doesn't want that? Now let's move on to the next lesson from How to Build Wealth on a Tight Budget. And that is, go beyond the wealth formula. In the pursuit of building wealth on a tight budget, it's vital to foster collaborative approaches that benefit all parties involved. Here are key strategies that go beyond the wealth formula and foster collaborative wealth building. Let's delve into real-life scenarios for each of these collaborative wealth building strategies. Firstly, networking and partnerships. Cultivate mutually beneficial partnerships and networks to harness collective strengths and resources. Collaborative efforts can open doors to new opportunities, expand market reach, and foster synergistic growth within constrained financial environments. For instance, consider a group of small-scale local farmers who collaborate to create a cooperative network. By pooling their resources and sharing distribution channels, they collectively expand their market reach and reduce individual costs, ultimately increasing their profits and securing stable revenue streams for all members involved. Plus, they get to enjoy fresh produce and exchange recipes with each other. Second Knowledge, Sharing and Mentorship Engage in knowledge sharing and mentorship initiatives to leverage collective wisdom and expertise within your industry or community. Sharing insights and experiences not only enriches the collective knowledge pool, but also fosters collaborative learning and growth opportunities for all involved. Picture a neighborhood association that organizes regular cleanup drives, educational workshops, and skill building programs for local residents. By actively engaging in community development initiatives, the association not only fosters a sense of shared responsibility and civic pride, but also strengthens social bonds and promotes a more prosperous and interconnected society for all community members. Not to mention, they get to know each other better and have some fun along the way. Community Engagement Participate in community engagement activities and initiatives that promote collective growth and development. Contributing to the well-being of the community fosters a sense of shared responsibility and strengthens the social fabric, ultimately leading to a more prosperous and interconnected society. Imagine a community of seasoned entrepreneurs hosting regular workshops and seminars to mentor and guide aspiring business owners. Through these knowledge-sharing sessions, budding entrepreneurs gain valuable insights and practical advice, enabling them to navigate the challenges of starting a business and fostering a supportive ecosystem that encourages entrepreneurial success and growth. And who knows? 
They might even find their next business partner or investor among the attendees. Last, but not the least, co-creation and innovation. Embrace co-creation and innovation as a means to foster collaborative wealth-building endeavors. Collaborative innovation efforts can drive the development of groundbreaking solutions and products that cater to diverse market needs, fostering inclusive growth and shared prosperity. Think of a collaborative research and development project between various tech companies and academic institutions aimed at developing sustainable and eco-friendly technologies. By combining their expertise and resources, these entities create innovative solutions that address pressing environmental challenges, fostering inclusive growth and shared prosperity while contributing to the advancement of sustainable technologies for the benefit of society as a whole. And they get to save the planet while they're at it. By embracing collaborative wealth-building strategies, you can harness the power of collective efforts and synergistic partnerships to create sustainable wealth accumulation opportunities. These strategies not only pave the way for financial growth, but also foster a collaborative ecosystem that benefits all stakeholders, ultimately contributing to the holistic development and prosperity of the community at large, and they make the journey more enjoyable and rewarding for everyone. All right, let's have a look at the next lesson from How to Build Wealth on a Tight Budget. And that is, invest long term. Just as Habit 5 encourages active listening for effective communication, investing for the long term involves strategic planning and patience, especially when building wealth on a tight budget. Here are some key insights on how to invest for the long term. Develop a sustainable investment strategy. Construct a robust investment plan that focuses on long-term goals and aligns with your financial aspirations. A well-thought-out strategy serves as a guiding beacon, ensuring steady progress and financial security over time. And unlike your ex, it won't break your heart or your bank account. Embrace diversification. Diversifying your investment portfolio is akin to actively listening to different perspectives. Spread your investments across various assets such as stocks, bonds, and real estate to minimize risks and optimize returns, fostering a stable financial future. Don't put all your eggs in one basket unless it's a chocolate Easter basket. Then go ahead and indulge yourself. Exercise patience and discipline. Similar to the patience required in understanding others, successful long-term investing demands discipline and a steadfast approach. Be prepared to weather market fluctuations and adhere to your investment strategy, allowing your assets to grow steadily over time. Remember, Rome wasn't built in a day, but it sure was fun to visit. Stay informed and educated. Keep yourself informed about market trends and industry developments to make informed investment decisions. Regularly update your investment knowledge and stay abreast of economic changes, as this will enable you to navigate market challenges effectively and maximize your investment potential. Knowledge is power, and power is money, and money is happiness, and happiness is, well, you get the idea. Leverage the power of compound interest. Harness the compounding effect by reinvesting your returns and earnings over an extended period. Compound interest acts as an amplifier, enabling your investments to flourish and multiply, thereby facilitating long-term wealth creation and financial stability. It's like magic, but without the rabbits and the hats. By embracing a patient and informed approach to long-term investing, you can lay a strong foundation for sustained financial growth and security, ensuring a prosperous and stable financial future, even within the confines of a tight budget. And that, my friends, is how you turn lemons into lemonade. Cheers! Now, moving on to the next, the topic how to build wealth on a tight budget is your response matters. Building wealth on a tight budget may seem like a daunting task, but it's not impossible. In fact, it can be quite fun and rewarding, as long as you respond to your financial situation in the right way. Your response matters more than you think, and it can make or break your wealth-building journey. Here are some examples of how your response can affect your financial prosperity. When faced with financial constraints, don't respond with despair and frustration. Instead, respond with creativity and resourcefulness. Find ways to save money, invest wisely, and generate extra income. For example, instead of buying expensive coffee every morning, invest that money in a coffee maker and brew your own. 
you'll save money, time, and calories. Or instead of splurging on a new car, buy a used one and save the difference. You'll avoid depreciation, maintenance, and insurance costs. Or instead of spending hours on social media, use that time to learn a new skill or start a side hustle. You'll boost your resume, your income, and your self-esteem. When faced with financial setbacks and market fluctuations, don't respond with fear and uncertainty. Instead, respond with resilience and adaptability. View challenges as learning opportunities and use setbacks as stepping stones. For example, instead of panicking when the stock market crashes, respond with calmness and rationality. Use the opportunity to buy low and sell high, or to diversify your portfolio and reduce your risk exposure. You'll benefit from the market recovery, and you'll sleep better at night. Or instead of giving up when you lose your job, respond with optimism and determination. Use the opportunity to explore new career paths, upgrade your skills, or start your own business. You'll discover new possibilities, new passions, and new sources of income. When faced with financial education and knowledge acquisition, don't respond with complacency and ignorance. Instead, respond with curiosity and a thirst for learning. Stay informed about the latest financial trends and investment opportunities and make informed and prudent financial decisions. For example, instead of relying on outdated or biased information, respond with curiosity and research. Use the internet, books, podcasts, or courses to learn about the best financial practices, strategies, and tools. You'll gain valuable insights, skills, and confidence. Or instead of following the herd or the hype, respond with discernment and analysis. Use your own judgment, logic, and intuition to evaluate the pros and cons of various financial options and choose the ones that suit your goals and risk appetite. You'll avoid scams, losses, and regrets. When faced with collaborative financial endeavors, don't respond with isolation and competition. Instead, respond with cooperation and collaboration. Leverage the expertise and resources of a community and access a broader network of financial support, guidance, and investment opportunities. For example, instead of going it alone or competing with others, respond with cooperation and collaboration. Join a financial club, group, or forum and share your experiences, challenges, and successes. You'll learn from others, get inspired, and find new opportunities. Or instead of keeping your financial secrets to yourself, respond with generosity and sharing. Teach others what you know, help others achieve their goals, and give back to society. You'll create a positive impact, a loyal following, and a lasting legacy. As you can see, your response to your financial situation can have a huge impact on your wealth-building endeavors. By responding strategically, positively, proactively, and collaboratively, you can turn your tight budget into a powerful asset. By actively seeking solutions and taking preemptive measures, you can mitigate risks, capitalize on emerging opportunities, and proactively shape your financial trajectory. Moreover, resilience plays a pivotal role in enabling individuals to bounce back from setbacks and adapt to changing circumstances. Building a resilient mindset involves learning from failures, leveraging experiences to inform future decisions, and maintaining a determined focus on long-term financial goals. By embracing a resilient outlook, you can navigate obstacles with perseverance, fortitude, and an unwavering commitment to your financial aspirations. Collaboration serves as a key ingredient in the wealth-building process, fostering an environment of shared learning, collective support, and mutual growth. By cultivating collaborative relationships, you can leverage diverse perspectives, pool resources, and access a network of support that propels you toward shared success. Engaging in collaborative endeavors nurtures a culture of collective well-being, enabling individuals to benefit from shared knowledge, experiences, and opportunities, thereby reinforcing their journey toward financial stability and prosperity. Remember, your response matters, so make it count. And don't forget to have some fun along the way. After all, building wealth is not a sprint, it's a marathon. And who says you can't enjoy the scenery? Let's dive into the next lesson from how to build wealth on a tight budget, and that is, you're doing the same. You know what they say. Insanity is doing the same thing over and over again and expecting different results. Well, that applies to your money habits too. If you want to grow your wealth, you need to change your mindset and your actions. Otherwise, you'll end up like these examples. A chef who follows the same recipe for years and wonders why their food is bland and boring. 
They need to spice things up and try new ingredients and techniques. Maybe they'll discover a new signature dish that will wow their customers and earn them a Michelin star. Or maybe they'll just burn the kitchen down. Either way, it's better than being stuck in a rut. An artist who paints the same landscape over and over again and wonders why their art is dull and uninspiring. They need to branch out and experiment with different mediums and styles. Maybe they'll create a masterpiece that will land them in a prestigious gallery or museum. Or maybe they'll just end up with a pile of garbage. Either way, it's better than being stagnant. An athlete who does the same workout every day and wonders why their performance is mediocre and unimpressive. They need to mix things up and explore new training methods and approaches. Maybe they'll achieve a new personal best that will win them a gold medal or a world record. Or maybe they'll just injure themselves. Either way, it's better than being complacent. The point is you can't expect to grow your wealth if you're doing the same things that keep you broke. You need to embrace change, explore new opportunities, and experiment with new strategies. Maybe you'll find a new source of income, a new way to save, or a new way to invest, or maybe you'll just lose some money. Either way, it's better than being poor, so the next time you catch yourself doing the same thing with your money, Ask yourself, is this helping me achieve my financial goals? If not, then it's time to change. Because doing the same thing will only get you the same results. And that's no fun at all. Unless you enjoy being broke, of course. In that case, carry on. But if you want to build wealth on a tight budget, you need to do something different. And maybe even something crazy. Who knows, you might just end up rich or maybe just happy. Either way, it's better than being bored. All right, let's dive into the next lesson from How to Build Wealth on a Tight Budget. And that is, nobody is perfect. You've probably heard the saying, nobody is perfect before. Maybe you've even said it yourself or used it as an excuse for your mistakes. But have you ever thought about how this simple phrase applies to your financial journey? In this lesson, we'll explore how imperfection is not only inevitable, but also beneficial for your wealth building and financial management. We'll look at some examples of how imperfection can manifest in different financial scenarios and how you can use it as a catalyst for growth and innovation. Let's start with some hypothetical situations. Imagine a group of aspiring investors navigating the tumultuous terrain of the stock market. Despite their extensive research and diligent efforts, they encounter unexpected market fluctuations and unforeseen challenges that underscore the reality of imperfection. They lose money, they panic, they curse, but they also learn. They learn to diversify their portfolio, to manage their risk, to adapt to changing market conditions. They learn that in the world of investments, nobody is perfect. And that's okay because perfection is boring and expensive. Consider a young entrepreneur launching a promising startup with ambitious goals and innovative ideas. Despite their meticulous planning and strategic vision, they face unanticipated obstacles and unforeseen setbacks that underscore the inherent imperfections of the entrepreneurial journey. They encounter technical glitches, legal issues, and customer complaints. But they also persevere. They persevere to overcome the challenges, to improve their product, to satisfy their customers. They recognize that in the world of entrepreneurship, nobody is perfect. And that's okay because perfection is overrated and unrealistic. Imagine a family striving to manage their finances responsibly, diligently budgeting and planning for the future. Despite their best efforts to adhere to financial discipline, they encounter unforeseen expenses and unexpected financial challenges that highlight the reality of imperfection in financial management. They face medical bills, car repairs, tax audits, but they also cope. They cope by adjusting their budget, by finding new sources of income, by seeking professional help. They understand that in the realm of financial stability, nobody is perfect. And that's okay because perfection is impossible and stressful. These are just some of the ways that imperfection can show up in your financial journey. But instead of seeing it as a flaw, a failure, or a fault, you can see it as an opportunity, a lesson, or a blessing. By acknowledging the role of imperfection in various financial endeavors, you can foster resilience and adaptability in the face of challenges. You can embrace a mindset that is better equipped to navigate the complexities of wealth building and financial management. 
you can promote a proactive approach to handling financial complexities, encouraging you to view challenges as opportunities for growth and development. You can adopt a forward-thinking attitude, leveraging lessons learned from past experiences to inform future financial decision-making. You can cultivate innovative strategies to overcome obstacles and thrive amidst changing financial landscapes. Embracing imperfection as an inherent part of the journey fosters a dynamic perspective, enabling you to adapt to evolving circumstances and emerge stronger and more equipped to achieve your long-term financial goals. And maybe even have some fun along the way, because in the end, nobody is perfect, and that's perfectly fine. Congratulations! You've made it to the final chapter of How to Build Wealth on a Tight Budget, where I reveal the secret sauce that makes all the other lessons work better. This is the part where you go from being a mere saver to a savvy wealth builder, from a frugal spender to a financial mastermind, from a budget-conscious consumer to a mindful moneymaker. Are you ready? Let's dive in. The secret sauce is called sharpening the saw, and it's all about embracing financial mindfulness. This is not some woo-woo concept that involves meditating on your bank statements or chanting affirmations about abundance. No, this is a practical and powerful mindset that will transform the way you manage your money and multiply your wealth. Think of yourself as a vigilant guardian entrusted with the protection of a priceless treasure, your financial future. Your job is to safeguard it from any threats, optimize its potential, and grow it over time. To do this, you need to master four skills that will make you a super effective guardian of your wealth. These are vigilant protection. This is your shield against unforeseen pitfalls and challenges. It means being watchful and attentive to your financial situation, keeping track of your income, expenses, assets, liabilities, and investments. It also means being alert to any opportunities or risks that may arise and being ready to act accordingly. Vigilant protection is like having a security system for your money, ensuring that nothing slips through the cracks or catches you off guard. Meticulous decision-making. This is your sword against imprudent financial choices. It means approaching each financial decision with care and thoughtfulness, weighing the pros and cons, and considering the short-term and long-term implications. It also means being clear about your financial goals and values and aligning your decisions with them. Meticulous decision-making is like having a GPS for your money, guiding you towards the best course of action for your financial well-being. Disciplined Financial Habits This is your armor against irresponsible spending patterns. It means developing and maintaining responsible financial habits, such as prudent budgeting, consistent saving, and smart investing. It also means avoiding or eliminating bad financial habits, such as overspending, undersaving, or reckless investing. Disciplined financial habits are like having a fitness routine for your money, keeping it in shape, and ready for any challenge. Resource Management Awareness This is your crown of wisdom and authority over your financial resources. It means having a deep understanding of the value and potential of each financial resource and managing them effectively and efficiently. It also means being aware of the interconnection and interdependence of your financial resources and balancing them accordingly. Resource management awareness is like having a dashboard for your money, showing you the status and performance of your financial portfolio. By embracing these four skills, you become a vigilant guardian of your wealth, sharpening your saw with financial mindfulness. You protect your money with vigilance, cut through the noise with meticulousness, strengthen your money with discipline, and optimize your money with awareness. You harmonize these lessons and unlock the secret to sustainable financial growth and prosperity. As we conclude our discussion on how to build wealth on a tight budget, remember that your financial well-being is within your reach regardless of your circumstances. What's one practical step you're committed to taking today to start building your financial future? Share your thoughts with us in the comments below. If you're interested in learning more, grab any audiobook of your choice for free by clicking the link provided below the video. This video is for educational purposes only and does not constitute investment advice. It is important to conduct thorough research and consult with financial professionals before making any investment decisions. The value of investments can fluctuate 
and past performance is not indicative of future results. Always assess your risk tolerance and investment goals before allocating your capital. I recommend you watch the next video in our series. Don't hesitate to share this video, subscribe to our channel, and share your thoughts in the comments section. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in my next video.